Greetings everybody, welcome back to Tunic. Uh, last time we managed to strike the West Bell after a very long and grueling fight with a, a boss. Um, whew, that was a lot, wasn't it? <laughs> I was thinking about that. Like, I quite like that kind of gameplay, that kind of combat where you're, you know, you're going into a boss fight repeatedly, but learning the patterns and everything each time. I think that's what people think of as like a, a Souls-like combat. I've not really... Oh, not even, not really. I, I've not played a Souls game ever, um, but I have played other things like like Hollow Knight has like that kind of combat in its boss fights, um, that kind of thing. Um, well, but yeah. Anyway, so I was thinking about that, and uh, like it's interesting that despite the fact that you know you're progressing, and like like you're not like like failing like 10 times before finishing the boss is part of finishing the boss, right? And like, I always, whenever I, oh gosh, I'm going all over the place. So, okay, so, <laughs> so like with Sokoban games, which I play a lot of, um, a common complaint you'll hear is that like, oh, it feels bad when you have to restart or whatever. Like for people who aren't familiar with Sokobans, um, and then the advice you have to give is like, oh, that's not a, you know, that's not a failure. That's, you know, uh, restarting and undoing is like part of the process of exploring the state and figuring out how to beat the puzzle. I guess you could say exactly the same thing about like the process of fighting the boss over and over until you get to you have a full understanding of how to defeat it. Like the, the argument pretty much works for both. I think maybe it's a little bit different because there's more repetition in a like in the souls like learning how a, a, a boss works. There's quite a lot more repetition in it, so maybe it's a little bit different in that sense. Um, but also, I mean, the thing that I think was an issue with that boss, and I remember having this issue with the boss in Hollow Knight as well, um, was that there was a bunch of stuff between the reset point and the boss that was quite frustrating. Like, it's kind of annoying to have to go through that every time just to get back to the boss where you're going to learn the thing that you need to learn to actually beat the boss. Uh, like, sure, maybe it's interesting that it puts you in a slightly different state each time, but I don't know, not interesting enough. But it's, it's interesting that it, it still leads to frustration, despite the fact that I know, I know I need to die to this boss many times before I'm going to get it. And it's like a good kind of frustration, but it's definitely more of a frustration that I would get, like from restarting in a puzzle or whatever. Restarting in a puzzle to me is like nothing. <laughs> so why can't I think of dying in the boss fight as nothing? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, it's a good kind of frustration. I do enjoy that process still. Uh, I'm assuming since we've hit the two, like the East Bell and the West Bell, we now could go in here. That was the implication, right? Because we went to this before. Oh yeah, it looks like it's over there. It just pushed me out the way. <laughs> Okay, cool. So yeah, like we went to this before and it gave us like a vision of hitting the two shooting forks. Why have they called them bells? They're not bells at all. They are shooting forks. Okay, where are we? What's this place called on the map? Uh, if I can figure out how to get to the map. Uh, this place is called Sealed Temple. Okay. Hello, friends. Okay, the three things, the three hexagons. Something three, yep. Sure thing. I guess I'm gonna be decoding that at some point, right? Like I will be able to read that text somehow. Hello. This is is this this is not the geometric thing that the the other character was trapped within, right? Or maybe it is, maybe it's related. Okay, so this is interactive. Blue. Oh I see this one here as well. Okay, so I did notice on my, yeah, okay, so there's red, green, and blue. I noticed on this thing at the top there, there's a, there's like three slots for things that I'm gonna collect, I guess. Uh, and then there's another one here, which will be the other color. Green. Okay, wait, is this a path? This is a path. Are there other paths? Hold on, before I run that way. Oh yeah, they can run now. Let's not forget that I can run. I think that's the only path. Okay. Like, I'm glad there's a path because otherwise I'd be like, okay, where am I going next? 
up the ladder. Uh, I cannot tell what's a surface here and what's not. There we go. Uh, this way, I guess. Aha. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> so this is page 24. We did have references to 24 somewhere, didn't we? 24, Ableton. Ah, but this is only half of a thing. That's cool. So A button, three seconds in front. Okay, so if I hold A for three seconds in front of one of those things, something will happen. Maybe I get one of those. Oh, that's a continuation of that. That's interesting. Oh yeah, red, green, and blue represent health, stamina, and magic as well. That's curious. So you'll say, if I go and hold that, does that do anything if I just hold it for three seconds now? Oh, it does. Are you telling me that's always been a thing? <laughs> it's, po it's totally possible that's always been a thing. <laughs> okay, I remember seeing this bridge in the trailer. That's the path I walked in on, right? I think so. It's over here. Nothing. Okay, so if I if I kneel down in front of those things, something might happen. Oh, where am I go? Where am I go? Uh, there's got to be something here, right? Huh? Oh, there's a. Ladder that goes up. Ah, there we go. Are you a different one? Oh, you're the... Uh, the purple one. Yeah, okay, cool. It's funny how easy things are now. <laughs> now that I know I can increase my stats. Uh, okay. That's another thing is I think I was like set back quite a lot by the fact that I spent like a thousand coins on something. I think I spent it on a shard of a health bottle thing. Um, which is probably good, but probably not as good as spending on stats. <laughs> okay, I don't think I need that view, do I? I mean, maybe I do need this view. Is there something about this that is interesting? Like something I should be paying attention to? At least I'm not seeing anything. Also, I wanted to point out that this is something I thought about since last time is the text is like, as I've pointed out, it's like cuboids. Um, like in an isometric view and the world is an isometric view is there some connection between those two things is there like text in the environment like like maybe this is some text <laughs> okay maybe not that but somewhere oh look there's a complete gold thing here is that oh yeah that's an item i remember seeing that in the manual the, the staff the fire staff thing um what do you do? Do you do something to this? No. Okay, so you shoot. Does that use magic? It does. Okay. Oh yeah, it says 13 as well. So you shoot like a, a bolt of fire or something. Do you interact with anything? Nope. How do I do anything with this? Hit it with my shield. Can I do something with these? Can I hit them fast enough? Maybe I, I pray. Nope. Ha. Huh. I kind of feel like if I hit those simultaneously or something, something will happen. Or oh, once again, there's a path on the, the thing. Maybe the path means something. I don't know. Do I just walk away from this? Or am I supposed to be figuring something out? I guess we at least know we could go pray next to some uh, of those cube things. Although, where have I seen them? Are they all shown on the map? Hmm. 
You dead. Ow. Alrighty. What's up here? Uh, what is up here? Oh, the very top. The tippy top. Mountain door. Where's the door? This music now reminds me of... Oh, is it, maybe this is what I was thinking of before, but the like underwater music in Donkey Kong Country. <laughs> I remember before I was saying like, oh, there's like another song that has a similar like arpeggio, but with a different chord change. I've sort of just been running straight through and not been looking for secrets. I guess I'll look for secrets on the way back down. What's this? <clears throat> yes, I will take it. Why would I not take it? Cyan Peril Ring. Defense. Peril. Inverted Ash. Lucky Cup. Muffling Bell. Page 51. Cards. What? So below my shield and my magic bottle. No, what is that? Ice grenade or something? <clears throat> no, it's not. It's, no, it is a magic bottle, isn't it? Or something? Uh, oh, it's the lantern. Yeah, okay. I don't have a magic bottle. Um, sure, there's a slot. And I can put a card into it. Aha, I can, okay. So I think at some point I got an extra slot here. Is that what happens? Are these buffs then? They do something. Yeah, maybe. Uh, what is this? Oh yeah, okay, so throw coins into the well. I already figured that out. Two, three, four, five. What did that do again? Didn't didn't that give me this? Maybe it did give me this. But then what's the what's the two, three? Like I put three coins in. Right, okay. So three coins, two. And then if I wanna get three slots, I wanna put three more in, then four more, then five. I think I understand. It probably doesn't matter which well then. I can do any well. Okay, so then, so this is like an attack boost, and this is a something, what was that called in the thing? Uh, it's not there. Oh yeah, this is the page, okay. Um, the temple three key, oh my gosh, so many things, help, hints and clues. Oh look, text here as well. What are you telling me? So that, the text of the speech bubble is the same as the text just below. And then is this like pulling it apart in some way? Like it's changed slightly to the next level down. In fact, yeah, you've split some stuff apart. So like that first character well, the circle's disappeared, which is interesting. But the tick, there's like, so the first character, there's a, like a, a pointy up shape of a tick at the top, which is shown in the next line below with a arrow pointing at the circle. And then the line below that, we only have the pointy up shape. And the line below that, we only have the tick. Okay. And similarly for the third character, we've taken the like pointy up shape off the top and moved it down. Oh dear, oh dear. I feel like deciphering that text is gonna be quite complicated. I don't get it just yet. So these, are these cards still? These are not cards, these are something else. 
Oh gosh, oh gosh, we'll come back to old oh, burying ground. There's some text there. So yeah, I guess once I can decipher some text, this might make more sense. The temple, three keys, red, green, blue. Okay, okay. Uh, what is this though? Pray? I'm gonna have to pray everywhere now. Uh, there are some stairs here, but nothing there, I don't think. Anything back here? Oh, oh, hello. Hello. I found something. I found a whole area here. Very long spiral staircase. Ah. Did, did I just see some stuff jump out of the water, or was it just the items that came out? I don't know. Uh, well, I guess this is this way as well, before I go down there. Where am I? Uh, does this lead anywhere? Oh, it would, I see, okay. That rope would down. No enemies yet. There's a healing place over there. Okay. Uh, uh, yep. The quarry. Okay, that's where we are. What's this? Some kind of like yeah, some kind of mining machine. It's got like a drill at the front. Anything behind the waterfall? Oh, well, something in front of the waterfall. Okay, another part of a health potion. Don't mind that at all. Uh, this is a strange effect. Wait, I'm losing health. Whoa. Even worse, my health bar's going shorter? What the hell? Uh, will it go back up? I would appreciate it if you would go back up, health bar. Yep, my health bar is definitely getting shorter. Let's move away from that. Uh, is there anywhere else to go? No. Uh, maybe we save that for later? <laughs> when we have more health bar? Huh. Oh. Well, I don't have any maps to do with this, right? Under the well. No, I think at the top right is not that. Uh, what is this? No. Oh, look, the purple channels are on here. All those statues, like uh, these oblong things, oblong, <laughs> nobody says oblong, are these the things I need to pray next to? I don't think so. Okay, so many places to go. So many places to go. The frogs to me, I completely forgot about that as well. Um, okay, I think I'm not ready for this place. Please give me my health back. I would very much appreciate it. Maybe I have to die to get my health back. Hmm. Yeah, maybe. Yep, seems to be permanent. Okay, well, I'll just die when I can.
guess it could have died down there. But we'll head back down. Let's just check if there are any secrets we missed on the way up. Anything here? Feels like the kind of place they would put something. No. Guess not. Yeah, here. This feels like somewhere they put something. No. No. No chest, nothing. Nope. Apparently not. Okay. Okay, so there's some door up there that I don't know what to do with. It didn't seem to interact with me in any way. Or I didn't interact with it. Anything like if I don't go down those stairs? It's very bright. Alright, down the stairs we go. Uh, I've not been over here yet, I don't think. Hey, friends. Ow. Okay, you've got the shield. Yep. Ow. Okay, this is not going well. I did say I wanted to die, but maybe not immediately. Hey, friends. I'm back. Two hits. Ah, why did I not dodge? Ah, took it down the ladder. Okay. Chest. What do we have? A blueberry. I think those are for magic. Do you want to maybe not hang out there? Okay, so I don't get damage when I land on them. That's alright. <clears throat> Anything here? Okay, tuning fork. Aha, this is going to be a shortcut. Somewhere. What changes? That goes down, there's a ladder. Alright. Before I do that. Why does this exist? Ah. Okay, we come across the other way. Got it. Is that connected to here? Do I just go down here and then like to the northeast? Maybe. Well, that's pretty simple. What are you about? You're very suspicious, aren't you? <laughs> I'm just going to kneel next to everything now. Uh, what about this? I should probably use that on an enemy, find out what it does. So set them on fire. I mean, it hurts you. I guess it's just a projectile weapon. Hmm, there's another tuning fork there with a bridge to a chest. Is, are they like warp points or something? What's this? Oh, well. <laughs> Guess I'm not going to find out. I'll find out by going in. Oh my gosh, I'm going to so many places. Well, they could be going to a thing to kneel next to it. Okay, we got one of those. That's the decoy thing, right? Maybe. Aha! Well, there's the thing to kneel next to. I guess I probably have to actually be next to it. I don't think there's a path here. Unless, hold on, does that go through? Yes, okay. Nothing in there. A channel here that's off. This is unpowered. Is that connected to the fact that the channel is off? Dead. Uh, do I have any coins? Get a nice view of everything over there. Oh, there's a little person. Uh, don't think we have any coins. I see you, friend. I can lock onto you, friend.
What's this? Another one of those? Huh, interestingly, it seems to be on a platform. Like It's like the gold platforms that I've seen. Are they the same thing? Is this something that can go up and down? Maybe only if it's powered? Maybe only if it's powered. Okay, well, I'm next to this. I feel like I should be able to do it. So maybe this provides the power to the the channel. And that's going to do something to like turn this on and do something to this maybe as well. And then the other thing, the other column that I just came across that didn't react to me. Let's try it, I guess. Can I like raise them up and down or something? Something's happening. Yep, it's gone down. Okay, and this is indeed powered. Does it do anything to this? No. Uh, does however turn this on? Interesting. Oh, we should do some of this. Oh, I don't really have that much. Thousands. Okay, I can't do any of them. Right. Oh yeah, my health came back. Great. Okay, so we know the channels uh, are powered by those columns now. Why does it feel like I should be able to go this way? I guess because I can see stuff over there. So if that's powered, does that affect the column over here? Yes, that's now on. So I guess I can lower that as well. Or raise it, and then it'll lower. Yep. And I think this platform is the same as the gold thing, just inverted. Like it's silver in the middle instead of gold. Alrighty, we're learning stuff. This is fun. Is this... wait. Oh, this is the earliest page I've got now. Interesting. Yes, three locks, red, green, blue. And then arrows going across to the right hand side. Well, there's a... it's like the thing inside the temple, sure. It's got three red parts, three green parts, and three blue parts. Coveted in a forest temple, stolen to the top of the sky, sealed at the root of the world. Okay, this is where I get the three things. Got it. The three... <laughs> uh, <laughs> what sort of good alternative to the word force? <laughs> uh, the three... I cannot think of a synonym for force. <laughs> to force something. Um, gosh, does it have any synonyms? Anyway, again, the same battle. Fought uncountable times. Air to the air. Okay, so this is like the law. Same battle fought, fought uncountable times. So eventually I'll be able to read that story, I guess. Oh, don't zoom in. Interesting. Where does this go? Is that a shop? Here it is indeed a shop. Uh, anything I want? There's a coin. How much are the coins? I don't have I barely any money. I don't want anything. I'm good. I've got stuff. i got loads of stuff. Leave me alone, friends. Uh, those are interesting. Oh, I totally see what we can do here. What did it do though? Uh, apparently I have chopped down a thousand blades of grass. Cool. Is this a way to cross this if I blow something up, maybe? Or do I go down here? Wait, hold on, hold on. Is this a place on my map? It might be. I feel like I know this place. It's the... It's uh, this one. Yes, it is. I'm on the map. Look, I'm there. I'm next to that that shop. Okay, cool. Holy moly, what's going on? Um, page 30. So this thing I'm next to goes to page 30. This place? Maybe. Yes. Maybe. And why do I want to go there? 
for the X. <laughs> X marks the spot. Like I guess I must come down there. I'm gonna let's go down. Where am I going? <laughs> There's so many things. Beneath the eastern vault. So this is a vault, the eastern vault. Or oh, the vaults where the things are. Okay, so I start there. Is this a silly place to be right now? Okay, I can break this stuff. Oh gosh. Spooky. Ah, it's water. Very spooky sounds. No enemies currently. It's probably a way to go through here. Those almost look like prison cells above me, right? I guess I'm heading through to this. I guess this is fine. I don't see it. I kind of want to break these just in case there is something behind them. There is not. I just destroyed a bunch of things for the sake of it. Uh, what are you? Are you a spider? I think you're a spider. Well, that was easy enough. Did use a fair bit of magic to do that, though. Am I missing anything as I do this? Is there more down here? No, okay. Like, can I deal with you just like this? Are you the spinny things? You're not really spinning. Okay, you're just non-spinny spinny things. And you give me magic, which is handy, because I'm using magic now. Okay, spiders are no problem anymore. Uh, anything behind the walls full? Nope. Another spider back there. Okay, so two routes to go. Uh, map. Looks like they both kind of head to the same place, so I guess we'll take this one. So the spider up there. So this is just head back down. Yes. Yes, okay. Hey friend. You dead. Okay, I expected this place to be full of enemies that I wouldn't be able to handle, but so far it's okay. See where we're going. We're heading into that pool area. Then we'll probably head south and up the side. There's an X there, let's not forget that. So this room might be full of a lot of enemies actually. Or not, just one. Uh okay, a few. Okay, a few. I only got one. Amazing. I mean, I guess they didn't do that much damage, so it's kind of fine. Why do they have something on their back? There was something about them like, it's like camouflage or something, or like, deception. Maybe it represents how big they are, because that one is bigger than the others. Okay, it's fine by me. <clears throat> Anymore. Did they come from behind the waterfall? They did. They did indeed. That was a nice clue. Okay, we've got another card. Did I assign two cards? No. What do I think that will do? What do I think that will do? Muffling bell. Maybe it makes me quieter? the exact opposite you'd expect a bell to do, but I guess that's the point. It's a strange magical bell. In that case it is a bell, <laughs> not a shooting fork. Uh, that's one of the, the things, right? The things that shoots, maybe? Let's find out, let's go close. Or is it something else? It's something else. Oh. 
Do you, do you do anything else? Can I toggle you off or... No, you just... Oh, oh, I see it made a platform over there as well. Okay, interesting. It's a switch that creates a platform. Why are we introducing that as a thing? I got some mushrooms. Okie dokie. Oh, hello. You're gonna die. You're gonna die. Oh, you made a big splash despite the fact you did not really go in the water. Okay. I guess you do give me a blue uh, money as well. A blue money. What's this? What's this as well? Hold on. <clears throat> Back to the map. Okay. Oh, X. X. Let's not forget the X. Oh no, I think I got the X, right? The X is just the thing that I hit to make the bridges appear. That's fine, okay. Now we're going to the, like, what seem to be like prison cells. Maybe? Where am I? Okay, I'm about to go into that bit. Yep. Concerning. Oh, okay, so shortcut back to the start. Let's not take it yet, though. Oh. Why am I hearing strange noises? Slightly concerning noises. Hello, friends. Are we friends? Are we friends? I don't think we're friends. Okay. <laughs> I wanted to be friends, and so you attacked me. Oh, hello. <laughs> Just roll backwards into this place. <laughs> Only for that to be an enemy. All right. Okay. Hello, hello, hello. Anything else in here? Oh, hello. <clears throat> flowers. Some lovely flowers. Really lightens the mood in this dark prison. <laughs> Uh, okay, there's a few of them here. So it's you lot, they're all talking, right? Um, maybe I should prepare with some other stuff? Or maybe I'm fine. I guess I could do with eating a berry or something. Uh, if I could find the right button. Uh, let's do... Uh, uh, uh. Okay. And then go back to the thing. Where is it? There. Okay, the others have noticed. Oh, there's only two others. Okay, this is fine. Especially because they only take four hits each. Ow. Ow. Uh, I'm on fire. I'm on fire. Can I stop being on fire? Uh, okay, I do stop being on fire. Um... I'm not sure I want to do anything to that. Let's just do this, I guess. Well, first let's drink. Then we do this. Well, that gives me magic as well. Oh, there's another one here. Are you just hanging out? Apparently so. No longer. You hang out no more. There's definitely something behind here. I see it. A coin! Cool. Throw that down the well when I get the opportunity. There's no reason I'd want to do this, right? I guess I could have used it in combat. So we just lit up this cable, which I guess is going to go back outside somewhere, maybe? Wait, what did that say? What's the name of this place? Tell me again, game. Okay. Are you going to load? Okay, that took a while. Okay, it's the Eastern Vault. Right. 
Makes sense, we're upstairs from beneath the eastern vaults. Where else do they expect to go? Alrighty. So then, okay, so we now back on this page. We are. Okie dokie. A bunch of stuff. Um, I'm gonna stop here. Uh, we're gonna continue exploring the eastern vault next time. Um, so it looks like there's a fair bit to get through. I'm not sure if we're going straight to that door at the top or if we're gonna be going along here. There's another door there that maybe just goes through actually to this space. But then there's like a candle over here. The mark on their backs is a trick. I mean, yeah. Am I supposed to be thinking they're like, they're money just lying around? They very much look like spiders, not money. Anyway, um, cool. Yeah, see you next time. We'll keep exploring this place. I don't know what we're doing here, but we're doing something. Goodbye.